What is going on, everybody? It is Starkler coming back at you with another one of the Toontown Rewritten Under New Management playtest videos. Again, this is for the community contributors. And today I am going to be fighting the Mint Auditor. And as you can see behind me, there are two different elevators on either side of me. You can't see my cursor because the Under New Management update is getting rid of things like coin mints and, uh, you know, like the DA office and the golf courses stuff like that so everything has just been like blocked off by all of these like money bags and crates and stuff like the elevators are just completely gone everything has just become kind of like a storage unit and it looks like i could actually stack myself on top of these oh isn't that nice I could just, like, take a picture of me on top of these money bags. Isn't that funny? Well, anyways, uh, I have to go and find a group because I am going to be showing off both difficulties for the Mint Auditor. Let me see if I can teleport to Iris. Hopefully I'm not disturbing them or anything. I think they're just looking for a group of people. Okay, good. This is the easy mode. So, again, I'm going to be showing off both of the difficulties for the mint. So I'm going to do the coin mint, and then after that, I am going to do the bullion mint. I was going to say, you can actually see gold bars up where the bullion mint used to be. You can barely see them, but everything's just become storage now. Just to show how small the population is, there's only 52 tunes on right now, so this is... Oh wait, this is gonna take a while. There she is. Okay, let's do this. We're gonna go and do the coin mint. Let's see, let me ask these people real quick. Checking out the other entrances. There's like no other entrances. Oh, they're all covered up. I can't guarantee anything, but yeah, you may have been checking out the entrances. We'll just get to the end as quick as we can. So again, this is the coin mint. So it looks like the levels are already much lower. So uh, let's just... I don't know, maybe I can just use a foghorn? Yeah, the fights are going to be really straightforward, but I think it's nice to show people what exactly you're up against. Uh, when this new update goes live, or at least whatever's happening right now, we can... We could walk around these, can't we? Oh, I thought we could walk around them. Ah, that's okay. No problem. Okay, so now we have a bunch of level 7s and a level 10, so maybe I can... What if I Stormcloud the level 10, and then everybody else just uses sound? And that person has organic sound. Oh, that's unique. And that's pretty much it for the second group. And I see some gag barrels, too. They're really going all out with this. Barrels... What do we have on the barrels? Ice cream and pianos. That's pretty nice. Next fight. What do we have in front of us? 9, 10, 7, 10. Okay. Even with less sound, we can still use it. Efficiently. And for a second, for a moment, I thought that was going to miss. That was going to make me upset. Now, I did see some pictures. I know that there was a new craning mini game that was added to this. I think it would be really nice to get to show that off if I get the opportunity. Except I might just have to keep doing coin mints until that crane game shows up. So we got a money thing. Just making sure everything's the same here. Oh, jeez. I'm falling through it. I'm falling through. Oh, that's not good. Please don't fall through the gear. Lift up. Oh, look. These are different. They changed this up a bit. They made it so you can't jump over those things because Toons used to be able to go above those pushers. Okay. Now, what is going to happen here? Is anything different? Let's see. We got dollar bills instead of money bags, but maybe those have been the same the whole time. I'm not sure. Still have the timer. Oh, the gag barrels are gone. Oh, no, they're still there. They just moved them off to the side. And, let's see. Okay. Good. I'll take the foghorn barrel. That's good. And the money slides out. Everything is mostly the same. I think they did a... The, they made the right choice pushing the barrels off to the side. So we have only three Skelecogs in this room. Huh. I'll give them a little expression. Two level 11s and a level 8. 
Is that the setup? Huh. Okay. Well, that's even better. Instead of two level 10s and two level 11s, you just have this. Two level 11s and one level 8. I wonder what happened to the other Skelecog. He must be, like, driving off to... I don't know. A Cog McDonald's. He's vibing. He's, he's hanging out at the bar. We have another Doom Room replica. Stomping all the goons. Uh, another Laugh Barrel, okay. I'll just ignore that goon. I think there was a second Ice Cream Barrel that used to be over there, but now it's gone. Uh, let's see, 77710. Reminder, this is a coin mint. I think this is taking a little bit longer to get through these as usual, even with lower level cogs. But that's okay. There you go. Good. Yeah, save all the foghorns in case our stuff starts missing. Can't wait to see how big the mint auditor's gonna look. I forgot to read the the bio for the case file. It says, The mint auditor is an analytical supervisor who sees both sides of the coin. His calculative investments make him prepared for any situation. He resides near the mint vault and the cash bot mint. Okay. So he's just hanging out. Again, these supervisors replace all of the regular supervisors in the game, so as far as like placements go, there's not any notable difference really, except the cogs are facing the other way. What is this all about? Huh. They're kind of just facing a different direction, I guess you just touch them? Oh, a cutscene, okay. Make sure your timesheet is on my desk by the end of the day. It looks like our security has been compromised. You may have gotten this far, but the market is on my side now. Ooh, scary. Look at him. Time is money, Tunes. Don't waste time. Oh. Okay, well, let's just... <laughs> let's just go crazy with the sound. <laughs> Who cares? We're gonna finish him off. Easy mode. Right? Costs two times as much to use. What does that mean? All gags cost two times as much to use. What does that mean? Does that mean it's gonna use up two of them? Let's just go crazy. Oh, they're not dead though. Oh. So is that it for foghorns? I didn't notice those gag barrels behind us. I don't think we needed them, though. My, my tune doesn't have drops, so the piano's completely useless for me. So all gags cost two times. What's he doing? Yeah, it does cost two of them, and we can't use level sevens. Oh, that's unfortunate. This is very interesting, though. The fact that it would cost two times. That's pretty interesting but I think we could just take him out with sound. I like the music. The music's really good. So that's it for the other cogs. They are all defeated, but we still have to deal with the Mint Auditor. Synergy. I like that word, synergy. The market is hot. Oh no, he's getting angry. Look at those eyebrows. What did he do? What did he do? Are we just regular now? Our damage went up. Let's finish this fool off. And I think that's GG. He was almost dead from the... Or he was like halfway down from the sound. We're just going nuts with our pies and stuff. That's pretty much it for that. So that was good. That was... Uh, that wasn't so bad. But I'm expecting this next one to be very difficult. 701 cog bucks earned. Hey, I'm maxed, so I have nothing to gain from this except for fun exclusivity experience. If that if that rings a bell. Do these people want to do a bully in? We could just go right straight in. We gotta get gags first. We must get our gags. Oh, we're making friends today. Good. Okay, let's go get our gags. And here we go. Let's do this. 
So this is the bully in Mint. So this is the hard mode for the Mint Auditor. So let's see what type of differences there are. I really hope we get the craning mini game because that's going to be something completely brand new. And I want to do that so bad, so I'm going to try to stay one step ahead of everyone. And just like the Cellbot Factory, with the hard mode we have orange colored goons. Let's see. Oh, this is new. Oh, we have new content. Oh, I just took damage. Okay, so we have some cranes. And a laser. Oh, we probably can't touch those, can we? So we have to operate these cranes. This is really cool. Okay, so here we go. We're going to go toss our safes on the button. I'm going to toss mine up there real quick just so you guys can see. Oh, I missed. <laughs> I tried. Wait, can I... I want to toss my safe on the button. Can I toss my safe on there? It sucks that you can't see the top of the crane, but... Yeah, there you go. Little fun safe mini game for you. I think that's something. You know what? It's worth a shot. I'm happy that they're doing this. Um, I just really wish you could see the top of the crane over there. Um, let me just check real quick while I get my tune up. Can you see the top of the crane? There is the top right there, but you can't see it through anywhere else. But we got to disable the laser puzzle. Oh, look at these itty bitty goons. Oh, that's great. That better ties it in with the CFO, which is nice. Good. That's good. Well, that was nice. Oh, we got the stomper room. They changed it up a bit. There used to be a lot more open holes. Now it's different. Oh, wow. It's really different now. Oh, three barrels on each side. Hey, this is good. I like this. Even these small changes like this give the game new life. Almost got squished there. I'm okay. This is good. Sweet. But we haven't gotten to fight any cogs yet, so I'm still waiting on that. And now the lava room is slightly different. They did good on that. A little bit more... A little more versatile just to make it through. Let's see if Rosie makes it. Oh, she fell in the lava. I think that did like 18 damage. So it looks like we have a group of just three cogs, but they're not as powerful as the other ones. And these people took some damage. I got lucky. Me and uh, Iris got lucky. There we go. Perfect. Good execution. Let's see, which way are we going? Are we going this way? Yeah, I'm gonna eat after this too. For me, it's like almost six o'clock. So, do the two easy ones, eat, and then come back. Oh, she's gonna do another bullion. Oh, that hurts. No. Aw, oh, man. I'll spare you the details. This was kind of a slower fight, to be honest. This took us a couple of minutes to get this done. My math should be right on that. Yeah. I used to multi-tune on three cats, and I would do coin mints and stuff like that. I remember the combinations. And it looks like the next fight actually isn't going to be all that difficult. Those cogs look pretty small. Wait. A level 11 bean counter? That is strange. Okay. Um, so let's see. What are we going to do here? I'll use a lure. Good, you're gonna use a birthday cake. Have I used any throw yet on this tune? I don't even know. I haven't checked. I think I used like one birthday cake or something earlier. Yeah, I haven't used anything yet. I'll just use a birthday cake, I guess. I'll go get the cake barrel. I'm not sure how much more we have left of this, but it is a bully in mint. So don't expect it to be too long. Oh, what is this? Oh, this is new. So we have to climb up that gear thing again. Maybe they did some reorganizing on that. So that's like the ultimate wall climbing right there. You have to climb up through those gears. And there's the ice cream barrel off to the side as well. Hey, that's that's new. I like it. And the gears spin faster, I think. So let's see. We got some orange goons. The walls are much taller now. Probably just for 
for the sake of the invisible walls because it looked like you could jump over those beforehand. Uh, nothing over there. Okay, just making sure. And it looks like we have come to that one big sinister room again. And there's a level 8 penny pincher in here. What is going on with these cog levels? Wait, that just turned into a loan shark. Oh no, it, it moved off to the side. Okay. I must be losing it. <laughs> a level 8 penny pincher. That's bizarre. But I like it. It's like field offices, yeah. Like that meme picture of the level 20 cold collar. Oops, didn't mean to touch that. Oh well. Uh, let's see, can we wiggle our way through here? Oh, I touched the money bags. Good, everybody knows how to get through. Some people actually don't know about that skip. That little opening off to the side. Some people don't know about that. But there are no level 11s. Isn't that bizarre? There used to be so many level 11s throughout the mints and the offices and the the golf courses, and now it's just smaller cogs. I would say everything's become easier, for the most part. There's go going to be a moments. there's going to be plenty of moments where things become more challenging. But I would say this is going well, and I think we have a full set of four? We do have a level 11. Interesting. Looks like they updated the Unite panel. Like, they made the phrases panels a little bit smaller. They used to have a bigger outline. And we got that last cog. So I think the next fight is probably going to be the last one. Because I don't expect these to be too long. The only thing that was very similar as before was the factory. Yep, this is the final fight. Here we go. Level 12 money bags. Let's go join the battle. Wait, did someone just leave? Did someone disconnect? Oh no. Oh, it teleported them, I think. Okay. Yep, our sec your security's been compromised. Pretty much has the same body type as the money bags, except it's slightly bigger with more textures added to it. Okay, so again, we don't have access to any of that stuff. Do we do have SOS cards. Everything costs two. I want the cheese. Okay, they don't want to cheese it. I respect their decision. Uh, let's just... We'll just get rid of one cog at a time, and the lure misses! Oh, that's so unfortunate. They all have an extra 200. They should have used bigger gags or something. I remember cheesing the... Oh wait, there was a foghorn barrel right there and I didn't see it. That hurts, dude. This hurts to watch. It's gonna be tough. But, like I said, I got plenty plenty of Unites stocked up. I'm ready for action. I'm all mission. What's he doing? He's putting coins under him. Gave him extra bonus health. Okay, what's the plan of action? Someone offer guidance? Come on, someone, someone do something. These people look like they're slightly dazed. This will be my last lure, I guess, since I can't do anything else. That's a level 14 cog now, that's not good. And the lure hits this time, that's good. Let's get rid of that lone shark. Yeah, the supervisor, the auditor, he doesn't want to stay lured. What's he doing? Oh my gosh, he's buffing the money get money bags. That's not good. Is he going to attack? He is going to attack. How much is that going to do? Oh, just 10? Okay. What's he doing? He's heating it up. What's that doing? So our damage is going up. Okay. And we have access to level 7s again. Okay. Mm, what are we gonna do? We still have the level 12 lord. Could I just... I'll just do this. Maybe a little assistance and getting rid of that. Money bags will be nice. Lure hits. Okay, we got the money bags. And the supervisor 
he never wants to stay lured, ever. Yeah, that's okay. It's not a big deal. What did that just do? Oh, no. Our defense has gone up by 50%. Okay, well, since I have the most laugh out of everyone here right now, I call upon duty to do juggling balls. Hopefully they get rid of that level 14. It's going to take a lot to do it. Tune up 105. Didn't it used to just be like 80 or something? Or maybe I'm just thinking things. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> There goes the birthday cake, which only makes it yellow. And the fire hose misses. Oh, well, it's a level 14, so what else can you expect? And so does the piano. That's unfortunate. Money talks. Level 14, here we go. Just 10. Only 10 damage. Not a lot. Promoted. Level 16. Oh, that's, oh, whoops. This is not good. They just want to take out the supervisor, I guess. We can go for the supervisor. If someone's willing to use a lure and then someone teams up. What do they have for gags? They have cakes, but they're using a cream pie. Okay. We're just chipping away at him. The supervisor's gonna keep leveling up that money bags. As long as it's still alive. A level 18 money bags. What on earth is going on? I don't know what we should do. I mean, does anyone want to fire the cog or anything? I don't think anyone wants to go through with that. Oh, the double drop hit. You know what? I'm impressed. I didn't think that was going to hit. These guys just don't seem to want to pick anything that fast. TNT, drop, and a small tune-up. Does she have juggling? No. Yeah, everything costs two. We're just slowly working his way down. This one's taking a long time. We need strategy. And you know what? People are probably going to find strategy as time goes on. And that safe looked like it was about to miss. If you looked at that... That looked like it was about to miss right then and there. I'm not lying. I thought that was it. Is that going to be a level 20 money bags? It's a level 18 cog. Who's he going for? Just 13 damage. It's really not as much damage as I thought it would be. You know, the first hypno goggles missed, and then every lure after that started hitting, including the big magnets. That should be it. There we go. And we have a lured level 18 cog that we have to take out. And the lure is already broken. I guess he's too rebellious for that. Okay. Well, we're almost done anyways. Has everything gone back to normal now that the mint auditor is completely gone? Oh my gosh. We'll be okay, though. We got this. He should probably use a lure. Okay, he's not gonna use a lure. That's okay. It's all about knockback and damage. No, we're fine, actually. Never mind. If he used a lure, that would have killed him, though. But we squished him with the piano, and we have finished off the bullion mint. This has been a fun ride. This was okay. I liked it. 1,452 cog bucks earned. I know they changed the requirements for everything, so good job. We did it. That's the coin mint and the bullion mint for the under new management update for the second testing week. That was, that's it for that. Fun little journey. Everyone here is either a partner, a staff member, or some sort of community contributor. So just remember that. It's pretty cool seeing these people here. We all have a passion for the same thing. And I still have to give my feedback. So anyways, that has been the Mint Auditor. That's pretty much all there is to it. I like the new HQ design. Everything looks different. Everything is just slowly starting to come back together. And again, everything is all in the testing phase, whatever you want to call it. So. 
yeah, that's pretty much it for this, and I will see you guys in the next video when I go and fight off the office clerk in Lawbot HQ, so that'll be lots of fun. So, yeah, uh, have a nice day, guys, and I will see you guys later. Uh, let's wave goodbye. Bye-bye. <laughs>